Welcome back to the video. In today's video, we're going to be playing Planet Coaster. In today's video, we're going to be working on our entrance and also some of our parking lot and getting a few couple of final touches done on our adventure area. But um, I'll build the entrance and stuff and then I'll meet back up for you all to show me what I built. So I'm going to see you in just a moment. Alrighty, so um, I finished up the build. Um, I didn't really do the parking lot that I'm going to do in the next episode. But um, I did our like entrance area, so um, we have our guest relations. This would be where you would like buy tickets and stuff. Just have this little backlot area for it too. Um, bathroom here, which this is actually where I have the guests coming out of. So I just have the path rooted under here with the entrance to the park down here, and then you just come out and here's the spawn point. So if we just come out of there, but um, here's the bathroom. I also have some different stuff going. So um, I have these all set up to a trigger. They all go at the same time. Then I have these just going. And then I have our enter and exit side. So I'm um, on our enter side. If you have like any trash or stuff, you can throw it in the bin here. You would first put like your bag through the metal detector here. And um, you go through that, it would get checked. Then um, if you're just like normal cable de guest, it isn't like disabled, you would go through the metal detectors, but if you're disabled, you would come to the guy in the middle and he would like check you, and then here's our turnstiles. And then for the exit, on the left, you can just go out and exit as you would normally, and then if you're wanting to re-enter into the park, if like you need to go get something from your car, um, you would just get a re-entry ticket or a stamp, whatever, from this guy, and then you just come back in. And then um, coming along here, I had some rocks just to help clean up the path a bit more from the very gritty it was before. And then um, coming along here, we have the fence I put in all along here. I have a second guest relations, which I did forget to put a sign on here. But um, I also have a little backlot area here too. And um, I also just filled out all the terrain for this area and put the privacy fence all along the side of the road going out to the impulse coaster and then coming along here I clean up the path some more over here and then I'm um, coming over to here this is the maintenance area for the um, accelerated coaster so um this is just um, isn't necessarily a maintenance area it's just more of a storage track but if just some storage for it, so they wouldn't be really doing maintenance in this area. But if there's very little demand, they would just swap out a train, put it onto here, and then if the, in like the winter months or whenever they do need to take off a train for maintenance once a year for its complete teardown, they bring it over here, use a crane to um take it off the sword track, and then bring it to the offsite maintenance area for the whole park and then um this is just the whole area and then this is just um uh don't die fencing or just fencing just to keep people out and i did just need to make the road go or be split up by this one support here but that would be perfectly fine and then i'm um, coming on over to here we have our small little parking lot for the hotel which i do probably have to add a bit more onto this but um that i'll do in the parking lot episode um, this will be like the exit road for our um, little maintenance area back here. And then coming in here, so where our hotel is, probably want, should, we'll probably do something up along the big front here. But I'm coming into here. Here's our plaza, so here's our front desk. And if there would be a line, you would just come along here. But right now, obviously, there ain't a line, which there will never be because no one will ever actually use a desk. And then um, we do have like a little waiting room type of thing with couches and tables. So this area I just decided to leave open just because this would be where a whole lot of people would be coming back and forth. Um, mostly people coming in for the restaurant. And I have another little seating area here and then both these, that door and this door leads out to the restrooms. And then um, I did just put a restaurant stall in here. So this way, um, there is an actual restaurant here, and as you can see, tons of people are using it. But if we come up to here, I didn't decorate up here because we need somewhere to put all of the hotel things. And also the restaurant things, so I have that 
all throughout this like upstairs and um the areas that I haven't like detailed inside this building but I did just put in the railings just because as you could see and um, well that's pretty much it for inside of this building um coming out here um for our restaurant we would obviously need a little backlight area so I've just done the same thing that I did over here with just a nice long straight road coming along here and then our rocks along here and then when I do the parking lot episode I will also mess with the terrain along in this general area just because obviously terrain isn't perfectly flat everywhere and um so yeah and I also just have some trucks everywhere for that stuff and I also put in the um AC units and stuff on the roof but um that I think is just about it which I did also put in handicap parking that's an error realism aspect that I did put in and um, I do want to put in a fountain here, but that I'll work on the parking lot episode, then general parking, and then I'll um, probably put an air line of parking along here. I don't know entirely what I'll do for the entrance and exit for here. I might just do like a little like stand with just a person just sitting there monitoring who comes in and out of the maintenance area. But that I'll decide in the parking lot episode, and the parking lot episode will pretty much just be filling out all of this which is a huge parking lot and then I also do want to just put in a like main road going along here that will have everything coming off for the park but um that'll be it for this episode I do hope you've enjoyed it if you have make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one bye